Hey guys, it's Axel178 from the Mine Shack, and I'm playing on a multiplayer server. And I made this cool little redstone bowling alley. It's not really complex, it's, I just thought it'd be really cool to show you guys. So uh, here it is. Hopefully, you guys can hear me, and uh, yeah, I'll, I'll just show you how it works. Basically, you have your bowling balls, they're actually uh, dye colors, different dye colors. Um, and then there's two alleyways, one for player one, and this one for player two. And as you can see here, I made this little lapis lazuli poll, telling you who wins, even though you can kind of see who wins. And uh, there's only one problem with this. If, uh, I'll show you, actually. Uh, it, it's only supposed to be for fun. It's not supposed to be really epic. But, uh, see if I get all my bowling balls to knock over all these simulated pins aka trap doors and it says player one wins because the salaries for player one yay but also the problem is if the timing is really close this is what happens well sorry not the time if they both win this is what happens both of them <laughs> both of them go off so that's somewhat of a problem. I'm not too worried about fixing it, uh, just because it doesn't really matter. It's the the wind detection thing is only supposed to be a cool little add-in I put in there. Uh, I'll kind of show you how it works, just in case you want to make one yourself. Basically, I had one problem where all like that's why all these are staggered because. Sorry, I'm just showing you that they're all staggered. See, they're all staggered like that. That's because the redstone would have problems being beside each other, so I set it up like this. And both sides are identical, but I'll just show you this side. Basically, the redstone, the pressure plate up there pushes down, turns that off, uh, which uh, then turns that. Wait, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I, I just need to think about it for a sec. That turns off. That means that turns off. That means the hatch opens. Simple? Yeah. Okay. And then for the more complex row, which is this one right here. Uh, it's kind of hard to show you. As you can see, redstone up there. Uh, but down here, what happens is the pressure plate hits a piece of redstone, which turns this off, turns that on. And then turns that one off, and then uh, turns that off, which makes the pressure plate flip down to make it seem like the bowling pin's knocked over. And then simple uh, detection with and logic gates, really, really simple. Uh, that's not really complex. Well, sorry, it's not complex at all. But uh, I'll, I'll show you this side because I just remember it's a bit different. Um, as you can see there, you have a redstone torch there instead, and uh, so you just have this here instead. You have that, and that, and then, oops, that right there. So, see, they're a bit different, but they do the same thing. But one thing that is necessary on these uh, these two lower ones, you need to have those there. Because I had a big problem where this torch here uh, would keep on messing it up because it keep this wire on right there so uh, that's a big problem so you need to have those those things there um that's pretty much it and then just uh actually never mind I, I was gonna show you beneath it but basically it's just redstone uh if you follow or is it this wire it takes you to uh here I'll, I'll, I'll just show you i'll just show you or not uh, it just takes you to the little, this little uh, platform which has the redstone torch on it, but beneath the redstone torch is an inverter. Yeah. <laughs> so basically, that's how it works if you want to make a cool little bowling alley. The wind detection thing isn't that necessary, so th that's I'm not going to show you it because it's kind of pointless. Um, I'll, you want just because I think it'd be kind of cool. Uh, since you see it like this here. Where there's no, where both people can win. I'm gonna pause the video and then I'll come back and I'll have it so only one person can win at a time. So, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll be right back.
Hey guys, Zaxxon78, and I'm back with uh, my bowling alley, red, my redstone bowling alley with uh, victory detection, and uh, I'll show you it with victory de detection fully working. Okay, so basically, this player oh, has this is player one, by the way, that I'm uh, throwing the bowling balls on. Boom, player one wins. Now let's say player two decides to be cheap and they want to win too. Oh, guess what? They can't win. Then you're probably just saying, oh, you might have just disconnected the winning signal for uh, oh, player two. No, I'm not that cheap. Here, I'll show you it from player two. Player two's perspective. So as you can see here, player two is a champ, and uh, sorry, I, I'm, I'm on a server right now. Anyways, player two wins, and that is not Uber Hacks or Nova, it's just some guy, it's an account called Nova. And then let's say player one wants to win now, player one can't win, see, no win. And as you can see here, I'll just recollect these. And uh, I'll explain to you how it works. Oh, come on, glitchy multiplayer. Let me pick up the last one. Let me pick it up. Oh, dang it. There we go. There we go. Okay, so now let's say we just go down right through here. I'll show you simply how it works. It, it's really, it's really simple. Now um, I just added two inverters along this chain right here. And along the second inverter, let's say you win, uh, I think this is player two. Player two wins, they also have two inverters. And when it reaches here, it splits up and goes this direction, permanently turning this, permanently keeping this inverter uh, off. Because as you can see here, the wiring turns that one off and then this one on which keeps this one off, therefore they can't win. And then vice versa, uh, sorry, it's a bit confusing. When, where is it? When the wiring reaches this point, splits up, goes off around, around, and up, and permanently keeps that one, uh, permanently keeps this inverter uh, off. And you're probably wondering, why did you need so much room for this wiring? It should be really compact. Well, first I was going to do uh, RS NOR latches. Hopefully you know what that is. Um, I'll try and show you. Just kind of like that. And then... No, I, I, I'm not going to show you an R, R, RS NOR latches. Because you should probably know it if... Uh, and uh, you should probably know it if you're going to be doing redstone. And if you don't, then just search it on YouTube. And this is being a bit glitchy, as you can tell. Just go back up to this room. Anyways, this is my uh, redstone uh, bowl. Redstone, yeah, my redstone bowling alley with uh, victory detection. And yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed watching this video. And leave any likes and comments, so uh, I'll be inspired to do more redstone st uh, creations and stuff. And uh, I'll see you guys later. Bye.